We're happy to have them at home. Uh, it's two teams that uh, they, they've been playing very well. Uh, both those uh, both those schools so far. Vanderbilt's uh, six and two. Uh, they've got a new coach. They're playing with a lot of energy, uh, a lot of enthusiasm. They played a good schedule, so um, you know that's going to be a great game on Friday night. And uh, Kentucky comes in here uh, with only one loss on the season. I'm excited about where our group's at right now too, and we're looking forward to uh, getting started. Well, it's just momentum that we can build on. Uh, the, you know, gives the, the players the deep belief uh, that they need, uh, that they're a good team, um, and that we can get it done on both ends of the field uh, and find ways to get uh, a result. You know, coming off this weekend was, I think it was an important exercise for us to go through because it was uh, frustrating. Uh, we really had to dig down deep uh, physically to push through the game on Sunday, but we found a way to win and uh, that's a good sign. I expect this weekend to be the best weekend yet uh, at our stadium. Um, opening SEC weekend for us, uh, Friday night uh, is, is always an electric atmosphere. Uh, it's the night before football teams play in Arkansas. It's our soccer alumni weekend, so I think we're going to have you know 40 of our former players back here. Uh, that's going to be really special to me to, and our players to be able to spend time with those ladies that uh, yeah, meant so much to this program. So uh, on a lot of different levels, uh, this weekend up at the Alabama Soccer Stadium is going to be special, and uh, I can't wait for it to get here.